The heart wants what it wants, and Selena Gomez's might be falling for a new man. The only murders in the building star and the chain smokers Drew Taggart are reportedly dating per Us Weekly. According to a source, the pair are trying to hide their romance by sneaking around at members-only clubs, and are very casual and low-key. The Insider also reports that Selena and the 33-year-old musician spent their time going to movies and bowling, calling the Lose You to Love Me singer so affectionate. Selena can hardly keep her hands off him, the source told the publication, adding that they are having a lot of fun together. While the pair have not publicly confirmed if they are together, the news of their budding romance comes following Drew's split from Steve Jobs' daughter, Eve Jobs. Although Selena has been staying mum about her relationship status lately, she has been open about her mental health and wellness with her fans. In November 2022, the 31-year-old spoke to Access Hollywood's Zuri Hall about why she wanted to release her documentary, Selena Gomez, My Mind and Me, which chronicles her journey over the last six years. First of all, congratulations on this project. And secondly, thank you for making it. Like, I'm not going to get super emotional, thank you. but thank you for making it. Um, you know, it took a lot of brave vulnerability to share a story like this, your story. And I just spoke with Alec, who yeah. said that you gave him full license to do what he would with your story. How much vulnerability, how much, if any, fear was there attached to that? Oh, yeah, I'm still scared, actually. Yeah. It, it was very uncomfortable, to be honest, in moments. But then I feel like it was also necessary. I yeah. thought the story needed to be bigger than just me and my music. I, I think it took a life of its own, and he just created the story that truly is my life in a time capsule. Yeah. Your life in a time capsule, it is inspiring. It's gut-wrenching. You know, I ask this next question, and I don't ask it lightly, and only so much as you're comfortable sharing, but that log line behind us says, every breath, a breakthrough. What does that mean for you? And in your darkest moments of that struggle, what did you maybe fear most? I think I was scared of myself. The way I was treating myself the way I was talking about my body it breaks my heart to, to think that's who I was and it was really heartbreaking for me to know that I hope I never I just don't want anyone to feel what I feel or has walked through I feel like you this can't not be an emotional <laughs> carpet for you what are you feeling right now and why i'm very nervous um this has been exciting but a little overwhelming to be honest i think i am still like a little shaky but i'm excited to be here and i'm happy that it's going to be released so really quickly anyone struggling at home yeah. who may be watching and going through something similar who may feel like their darkest days are still ahead what would you say to them what would you encourage them i with? would encourage them to to be not afraid to seek help, but at the same time, learn about it, understand what it is, because once you have the knowledge of what you're going through, you're less afraid of it. So I would say learn as much as you can.